Top military officials from South Korea and China are holding a third round of bilateral defense strategy talks in Seoul as we speak. This is an annual vice ministerial level meeting, but this year's talks have attracted extra attention as China's controversial new air defense zone is part of the agenda. For more, let's now connect live with our defense ministry correspondent, Han Daen. Daen, fill us in. The meeting, good afternoon guys, the meeting between South Korea's Vice Defense Minister Pek Sung Ju and the Deputy Chief of China's People's Liberation Army Wang Guanzhong started at around 9.30 a.m. here in Seoul. The two are known to have sought ways to bolster bilateral defense cooperation and, of course, touched upon the controversial issue of air defense zone. The meeting is not yet finished and we're still waiting to hear the outcome of the talks, but military officials in Seoul say they lodged a complaint against China's new air defense zone, which includes the Korea-controlled Yodo Island, uh, and asked for a peaceful resolution to the problem. Uh, Korea uh, has also made clear that it will not accept Beijing's unilateral declaration of the new air zone and will call for, uh, actually called for, a redrawing of the zone in a way that doesn't affect Korea's national interest. Yunji? Taeyun, could you tell us more about how the two countries' air defense zones overlap? Well, China's newly declared air defense zone overlaps some 20 kilometers in breadth and 115 kilometers in length uh, with the airspace west of Korea's Jeju Island as well as over Yodo. Now, the problem with Yodo, a submerged outcropping, uh, is that it lies in waters that both Korea and China claim as part of their uh, economic, exclusive economic zone. So the air and sea zones of both nations uh, overlap over Yodo. South Korean Defense Minister Kim Guanjin said he will push to expand Korea's current air defense zone so that it includes Iodo, uh, but we'll have to wait and see how today's talks go. Back to you. Well, thank you very much, Dan. That was our Handan reporting from the Defense Ministry there in Seoul.